Only the director says cut. <laughs> hey, YTPC. Dingus McSwine, James, and uh, a friend of mine stopped by, uh, Red Mist. He doesn't talk. Um, so I just got back and picked up some of this Seattle Pipe, Seattle Pipe Club's uh, Plum Pudding. And uh, thought I'd do my first uh, review. So Red Mist is going to help me smoke it. Um, I don't know if he can uh, exactly tell you what it tastes like, though, because he doesn't talk, so. And, what? That was kind of underwhelming. I was hoping for a hiss, but, uh, I don't know, pop's okay. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Almost smells like a, like a spicy barbecue sauce. You can definitely smell a lot of ghee in there. Or some people say Latakia. We all know neither of those is right. So, um, yeah, you know, I gotta say, I just watched Cass, Cass Piper, Cassidy, yeah, uh, just do a review on uh, or a, a video on plug and uh, and uh, whatnot. But I gotta say, right now, it's uh, I'm not remembering anything he told me. <clears throat> so sorry, Cass. But. I'm going to kind of do this my own way because I want to get this uh, going in on the road. So I'm going to break this up. And uh, I'm going to stick it in my pipe and smoke it. So the, uh, the tin note, it's like a spicy barbecue. Uh, the tobacco, it's moist. Um, but not too moist. It's almost like a, it's almost like an aromatic the way it's breaking up. But this is a, a Balkan, so yeah, spicy barbecue sauce. Yeah, so I had a fun trip down to uh, Cigar Savvy, in the Tri-Cities area. I think it's Pasco. Um, if you're in the area, you know, check them out. Uh, they got good prices, great selection, and uh, they're very knowledgeable. You don't have a lighter, do you, Red Mist? There you go. Oh, yeah, okay. Ah, he's going to get one. <clears throat> That's robust. <clears throat> yeah. So red mist likes it. Um it's like a it's like a robust cigar, really. Oh, I picked a cob up today. It's kind of bright there, but at uh, Cigar Savvy, and I, I got the cob to try the uh, Panzans. I'm supposed to be getting from Martin over at uh, Over Pipe. Yeah. 
yeah, I thought I'd break it in with some of this. Or, yeah, some of that. So, the tub, I'm not going to call it a tin. It's not really a tin, is it? I mean, that's a tin. And that's a tin. That's like cardboard and tin, so it's, I don't call it a tin. I call this a tub. But, uh, it's an English Balkan blend like no other. Hmm. Red Mist will be the judge of that. Um, hmm. Crafted and presented, pressed carefully together. Ooh. Many pipe smokers say it's their perfect tobacco nirvana, said one reviewer. I don't know if it's nirvana. You think it's nirvana? No. It's, it's good. It's not bad. I honestly, from the plum pudding, I mean... I just assumed there'd be more figgy taste to it or something, you know, maybe on the back side of the palate. And I'm sure I didn't break this up right because it is not, um, it's hard to keep, uh, keep lit. So, Cass, you can hit me up in the comments and let me know what I did wrong because, uh, I'm, I'm sure I put your video to shame. I'm sorry, sir. It's smooth. It's uh, The robustness is dying down a little bit. Yeah. Almost no sweetness. It's more of a just a savory type blend. But the Latakia isn't overpowering like I thought it was going to be. And the Preak's just about right. I don't feel like I'm sucking on uh, Tabasco. Oh, it's starting to pick up a little bit. Oh, I mean, first impressions, I'm thinking... Seven and a half, maybe eight out of ten. Hold up fingers. You can do that. Ooh. Yeah, we're pretty close on this. So you know we're right. Anyway. <laughs> this is Dingus and uh, Silent Mist here. And we're, uh, we're saying goodbye with some cobs. And we're going to finish this plum pudding. And, uh, you know, maybe on uh, What's Up Dingus, I'll bring up some final thoughts on the, uh, the rest of the bowl. So we'll see you. And uh, I'm going to be uploading that Monday instead of Sunday just in case you guys uh, actually paid attention to the last video <laughs> but um so dingus out have a good night and uh, we'll see you next time